1978, at Oldham District Hospital in Lancashire, history is about to be made. Dr. Patrick Stepto and his team prepare to deliver the world's first test tube baby. It was 11.47. This is a girl, as was expected. Her name is Louise, and her parents are Leslie and John Brown, and I am pleased to present this happy family to you. I don't suppose there are many people that can say within hours of being born they were world famous. The five most important people that have been in my life has been my mum and my dad, Bob Edwards, Patrick Steptoe and Jean Purdy. Because without those five people, I wouldn't be here and nor would all the other IVF treatment babies. It was a really emotional time for mum and dad. I don't think you'd even think how manic it was. They went from a normal couple from Bristol, not being known by anybody, to being in the spotlight. A sister came in and she said, um, Miss Brown, she said, there's um, a security guard come, coming up to take you down to see your baby. As I got, I think it was about five yards away from the actual double doors, which leads into the um, theater um, reception, I could hear this baby screaming her head off. <laughs> She was taken from the incubator then and put into my arms. And I think I had her for about two or three minutes. And I had to give her back, you know, I was, I was just shaking. And they put her in an ordinary um, class cot or perspex cot as they use in the hospital. And I, well, I just had to sit down. What was that moment like for you? Um, I don't think there's any words. Uh, I could explain it. The first couple of years, we went around the world. We went to the USA, we went to Japan, we went on television shows, interviews, rushed from place to place. Um. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's where I got her. Are you having any fun? Um. John Brown, Leslie Brown, go side this. Dozo. Eventually, Mum and Dad had had enough, and they just wanted me to have a normal upbringing and took me out of the spotlight. Now, it's pretty strange because one minute I'm being asked to do interviews and go on TV and do trips to Bulgaria and Brazil. Thank you, take care. And the next minute I'm at home just being a normal mum to my two boys. There are over five million IVF babies now um, and I suppose I'm part of their history.